Hey everyone, it's Juicy here. As you guys all know, it's now winter, it's snowing outside, and it's pretty cool enough for people to wear outwears around. So I thought it'd be nice to film videos about coats and jackets I have. Recently, when I was scrolling down my phone screen, I found this very interesting jacket brand's ranking pyramid of 2021, which has been a hot issue in the Korean community for a while. Just like there's fashion brands ranking around the world, this pyramid tells you which brand is the hottest considering the high quality, the price, the function, worth, and all that. And the interesting fact is that the pyramid says Montclair has the highest ranking, the second is Canada Goose, the third is Nobis or Stone Island, and the fourth is the North Face, Collinsport, or Columbia. The reason behind this, people say, is that Montclair is a luxury brand that you can buy an item and then give it to your children several years later, more than 10 years or 20 years. As I show you guys several Montclair jackets I have, I'm gonna be discussing the quality, function, price, and all that to see if it's actually worth the cost. The first piece is this shiny black Montclair jacket. This is the oldest jacket I have because my mom bought it in 2010, like 10 years ago, when it was not that well known as it is now. So you can't find the brand logo anywhere but here on the zipper in a very tiny way. Even though it has been more than 10 years, it functions very well and keeps me warm all the time. Because it's a bit flat compared to other Montclair jackets, it's very comfortable to wear daily and easy to store without getting wrinkled. The high quality material really lasts so I do agree that it's a luxury brand to give it to your children several years later. The next item is this short purple Montclair jacket. This item is also from 10 years ago. And when I wear this outside, I often hear some of my friends asking if I got a new one recently. So even though it has been a long time, the design never looks old and it always keeps me warm in winter. Instead of the Montclair logo being on the sleeve, there's a logo in the front on the pocket right there. And there's also a cute cartoon logo in the inner side explaining how to store the jacket properly. One thing I have to say about this is the inner side is filled with this vivid orange color. So I just think the combination of orange and purple matches very nicely. The material is very thick and instead of a zipper, there are concealed snap closures. There's also a hood on this jacket which can be detached so it keeps me warm all the time and very comfortable to wear it daily. shiny black short puff jacket. This one is personally my favorite because this shiny material makes you really look stylish and fashionable with just wearing this coat. Even though this is from seven years ago, the high quality of material makes the jacket look like a brand new one. It's very dense and thick as well, and there's a Montclair logo on the left sleeve and a cartoon logo on the inner side. One thing I have to say about this is it's very easy to store and take care of because this coat remains very clean without having to wash it or dry it and also it doesn't really easily get wrinkled so you can always wear the jacket as if it's a brand new one no matter how old it has been. The last item is this black long down puffer coat. This is a shiny material, it's very dense and thick, and it has a logo on the left sleeve. The long length keeps you very warm, 
And one thing I love about this coat is that if you zip it up, it turns into a very cute A-line coat. Love the quality, the design, and very comfortable to wear it anytime. That is all I have for today's video. Even though the price is high, I feel it's definitely worth it considering its luxurious fashion and design, its high quality material and style that are meant to last for more than 10 years. I feel like Montclair jackets make you feel very stylish and fancy, especially the one that has shiny material. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe. And please don't hesitate to leave the comments down below if you have any questions. So then I'll see you guys in the next video. See you soon.